Good morning. Good morning, everybody. Hello, Reno, Madame Reno. So, today you must know we are Friday. Yes, we are. We are Friday. 12. The 12th. 12th June. So, hello, everybody. Uh, we have maybe uh, sp today a special uh, of the cuff. Means we don't know. As usual, we don't know at all what we're going to talk about. There's a few things that have been happening in Oroville. Uh, there's some good news that I'd like to share with you. Yesterday, I got a response from L'Avenir ah, d'Oroville. You see. And they have given us uh, the permission to put up an FM tower. Uh, the working committee has been very helpful in um, finishing out the paperwork with us. So very soon, we'll be submitting uh for the exciting new development of uh, FM in Oroville. Oh, yeah. So that's really exciting. Mm. And so I'm very happy about that. The other thing I'm really happy about is that the RAS is uh, initiating open uh, meetings once a week with uh, Lavenier with no particular agenda, just where questions and answers can be given, which I think is a very welcome and needed thing because there definitely seems to be always... Um, an issue with control and tensions and how to develop and um, lack of communication perhaps, too much communication. <laughs> I don't know if that's possible. It's possible. Yeah. Um, so that that's really nice. That's a, that's a very good initiative. So it will be each Wednesday mm. morning. I'm not sure exactly. We're not sure, huh? but we will see. Uh, something hello about um, maybe a new publication came in French. Yes, it's uh, this uh, homage à Sat Prem. It was uh, translated in French um, and funded by uh, somebody. It's by Do Dr. Kirit Joshi. And uh, we've had a few um, uh, discussions on this book already, and also Ganga Lakshmi has, has read from it. And this morning it was interesting because we were talking about it. And... Uh, um, Yeah, there's some experience in it here, which is very similar to an experience by a yogi in the agenda where um, where they talk about the supermental force coming in. So we had a discussion about that this morning. But uh, here, this is interesting that what Mother says in 1955, she says, I think it'll happen, and I am translating loosely from the French into the English, so bear with me, uh, when an, a sufficient number of consciousness consciousnesses will feel in an absolute way that that it can't be any other way. Everything that is now and that appears will appear like an uh, absurdness uh, that cannot last. And uh, this moment, at, then at this moment, something could happen, but not before. However, even though, uh, even before that, uh, some change in a new reality would happen. And there will be. There was a moment when the mental being manifested itself on Earth. So surely there will be a moment when the supramental consciousness will also enter into the human consciousness and manifest itself. And then she says it won't just um, spread like some rubber. It could happen like a flash, in a flash. So that was in 1955 in the entretien. Yeah, interesting huh? to uh, to see that they, we have a moment. And I feel like it is a little bit when you look at the, the state of the world right now, both with the climate change, all the wars and everything, uh, there is definitely a sense of like, uh, it just, it's not like this anymore. It can't go on. I mean, the absurdness of today's situation is definitely um, obvious. Yeah, it's a kind of postmodern barbarism. No, we can say that, and we are, we are barbar with uh, new we, technology. Exactly, we behave yeah, like this Visigoths. Point is very dangerous. Yeah. Uh, so it's the moment, a crucial moment. Plundering, that we have, pillaging. Uh, In fact, our nature hasn't much changed. You know, from a sort of a Viking mentality, the way uh, <laughs> we treat everything else. It's amazing. It, yeah. uh, when suddenly you are in situation, immediately you can see that all our culture, our exactly. ethic, how exactly how explodes. The, that's the thing that I find so strange. I find it so strange that you know laws have evolved, become more progressive, art, and uh, the refinement of the culture. But in fact, uh, it really, I mean, it has to exist, but at the, but it's existed before, it disappeared. So it's not that that's going to bring the change, in fact. I mean, you'd think that uh, we're advancing.